I'm Edith Frenny, the playwright of Buena Vista, which you are hopefully coming to check out on April 12th and 13th. It's a play about um, trying to connect emotionally and psychically to the people who are uh, biologically closest to you in your life, the people who, for all intents and purposes, you should have the easiest time connecting to, you know, your parents, your children, but for whatever reason, um, you know, uh, can't seem to uh, form the bond that for some people comes really naturally. And the play is really about people being forced to come together and work out their issues in the best way that they know how, which uh, in their case is not the most healthy or um, the most constructive. I was inspired to write Buena Vista um, after a really abrupt, really painful breakup a couple of years ago, actually around four years ago now. Um, happened out of the blue. I had to do a lot of soul searching on my own and I sort of ran away from my life for a couple of days and started writing this play and uh, the play came very quickly. Uh, a couple of days I would say to get to the first draft. I wrote it all by hand um, sort of feverishly at my kitchen counter. I didn't really look at it for several months after after writing the first draft but after some time had passed I, I sort of had the objectivity necessary to take a good look at the play as a play and not just as the sort of rambling um, discovery process uh, for my own life. The development history um, was pretty much um, developed and produced at Steppenwolf. I went to Chicago and, and had a reading of the play early on with Laurie Metcalf who had been interested in, in uh, the lead role, which was very exciting. Steppenwolf was really excited about that play and they produced it in their first look repertory of new work last summer. Uh, since then I haven't really looked at it much so I'm excited to get back into it um, at Profile uh, this spring. It's a really interesting uh, process to go from having a production of a play to sort of getting back into the room in a development way um, and uh, seeing if there's any more work that can be done on the play. And I, I really love these characters and um, even though they're kind of horrible and the response to the play has often been, you know, these characters are so horrible. My feeling is just that, uh, that we write people off as being horrible or um, unpleasant or difficult and we sort of uh, deny ourselves the opportunity to sit in the room with them and accept the difficult people, accept what's difficult and horrible about ourselves because I think we've all got those uh, personality traits. Uh, if you want to experience the play in all of its glory, then um, I hope you'll come out and uh, see the reading on April 12th and 13th. It is sure to be a good time and I will be there and I would love to meet you in person um, and talk to you more about my play and about the wonderful reading that I know is going to take place.